it takes risks to learn and get to new research and new heights in like the space program, of course. And research and stuff, it just like unleashes unlimitable bounds like of what we can research, what we can see. It's evolutionary, it's cool. To see what else is out there. Because you can be in one certain area, but then that's all you know. It's always good to see what else is around you. STS-118 is going to be a really exciting mission. We're going to be taking up a section of the space station. In addition to that, we're also going to be doing a number of spacewalks. Barb Morgan will be flying with us as a mission specialist, educator, astronaut, trying to captivate the imagination of the youth of America, looking at that next generation of space exploration. fantastic. Uh, couldn't have been happier to, to couldn't have picked a better crew if I got the hand select from the astronaut corps. Uh, the whole team that's been working on it, the 13A.1 mission, has been fantastic to work with. We just have a lot of fun together and the people that you spend that time with, the people that you work with, the people who you depend on are really what make the mission most memorable I think and I think we're gonna have a lot of great memories. We've already created a lot during training. We have a good time. These flights are uh, very, very complicated and, and very full of content and uh, everyone has to be a fully functioning uh, crew member. I have uh, you know, very high expectations of, of all of us to, to get this job done. It's very challenging. You get to work with very dedicated people, not only the people that have the privilege of, uh, of flying in space, but all the people that train us and the engineers that work on the program and just everyone involved just has such a, uh, a love for what they do and it's kind of contagious and uh, I, I think that's where I get my ins inspiration from.